America's soap dramas are facing an uncertain future and the only certainty is that the last one standing will be the most popular. Given it's been the number one daytime show since 1988, we can rest easy about The Young and the Restless, or can we? Let's ask one of the show's most iconic actors, Melody Thomas Scott, who plays Nikki Newman. How are you? I'm fine, Andrew. Thank you very much. How tough is it today making these shows? Everything is done at a faster pace, um, from shooting it to preparing it, from lack of rehearsal to lack of being able to do another take. Um, we used to do five or six takes if necessary. Uh, if an actress had trouble getting emotion for a scene, we would wait. Yeah. Uh, mm -mm, not anymore. Um, I mean, just when you think you just couldn't possibly go any faster, word comes down from the third floor that you're about to go even faster. And the, the thing is, we deliver. We do it. Yeah. And so that if if we just were a little more unprofessional and didn't do it they wouldn't keep asking us to go faster. So we're doing um, roughly, sometimes more, 100 pages a day. Wow. And um, you show that schedule to somebody who's on a nighttime show and they will vomit. Yeah. <laughs> and you know what, a lot of the nighttime stars come into the world of soap, dip their toe, and a lot of them yeah, run they away. They it. can't cope, they can can't they? They can't do it. Tell me what it means for you as, as an actor to be working at that sort of speed. I mean, for some of the younger actors that maybe aren't as well trained as you. It does teach them their reflexes, well, right? Well, I like it. Um, well, it better. They better learn very quickly, too, um, because uh, there's not a lot of time to fool around before you might get replaced. Yeah. Um, I'm very fortunate. I've been acting professionally since I was three, and when I was very small, I uh, was enrolled in a memory school. Mind you, I'm from Los Angeles, so yeah. they, we have memory schools. We literally don't really look at our script until we're about to tape it. Oh, wow. And um, somehow that makes it more exciting for us um, because it's almost live and we're we're not quite sure if we're gonna, but 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 we're gonna get the essence across. We might say a different word than what's in the script, but. Um, I find that you get a better performance that way. When Doug Davidson was out here uh, talking about y and uh, he said something very interesting to me. He said that in his, oh. in his 30 years on the show, mm -hmm. the first thing that young people say to him when they meet him is, tell us all about Catherine Chancellor, who is the oldest character on the show. I'm never asked about Jeannie Cooper. My, the first question everybody asks me is, How's Victor? Yeah. <laughs> Do you think that the show needs more humour? Is that something that you'd want to see we more? We would love to do more humour and fortunately during rehearsal that's when we get all of that out of our system. Long May, The Young and the Restless Rain. I've been watching it for a long time. All right. I never miss it. And neither should you. See you next time. Thanks for coming on the show. Well, thank you very much. Thank you.